Hey all, Russ here, RVR TV. How you doing today? Hey, I'm out here off Parker Dam Road. We're gonna head over here to Black Meadow Landing. And this place is all by itself. It's way out on uh, Lake Havasu. And it's just plain gorgeous out here. This is a real windy stretch. It's about 10 miles off Parker Dam. We're kind of behind the dam on the California side of Lake Havasu. Look how green everything is. Hopefully we'll catch a few flowers. I brought the quadcopter. I think I'll try to fly it. Alrighty, we're here. Let's pull on in. I, they have a gate here. I gotta get a visitor pass. I was here about like three years ago. Alrighty, they let me in. <laughs> Let's go check her out. Okay, over here on the left, that's all the, oh, what they call their cabins. It's like a big motel. And now here's where all the RVs are. We'll drive past that. We'll go out. At, there's actually a big landing where all the boaters hang out. Check it out. No wind. I'm going to launch a quadcopter real quick. <laughs> I'll get parked. Alrighty. Look at that. Look at the calm water, too. This is picture perfect. Alright, I'm going to launch a quadcopter real quick, and I'll be back. Alrighty. Mission accomplished. I flew for only a couple minutes. You'll see the footage at the end of this video. Alright, look how... I mean, this place is plush. Look how the trailers back right up to the water, but also look how tight they are next to each other. I wouldn't want to camp like that. Sorry. And that's a premium price they pay here, too. It wouldn't be bad to do it for a week, you know, or two, but not to be here the whole winter. Look at the boat coming in. And <laughs> look at that guy. <laughs> so... All right, well, I'm gonna mosey back over. We'll get a few pictures of the ramp, boat ramp. Look, they got a gas dock here too. Big old marina. Look at that. And, well, it's Lake Havasu, and they got fuel, diner. I mean, this is a boater. Besides RVs, you, if you're a boater, this is a great place to come to. Everywhere you look, it's just scenic. Look at the mountains behind the RVs there. And it's great uh, Verizon signal here. I just checked it. Good signal. All right, I'm going to drive back over by the diner and motel. Way up top, there's a golf course here, too. I'll post links for all this stuff. Hey, there's the marina store. You can buy bait, propane, about anything here. Because you're a long ways from town. There's the diner. Supposedly they have good food. I'm not really hungry. And there's their motel. Alright, let's head up top of the hill. Alrighty. There's their gas docks. I have no clue what they charge. <laughs> that is a lot. There's RV sites up top here too. You can look down over the uh, whole uh, thing. All right, let me pull off. We'll get a few pictures. There's a view for you. Look down there. That's beautiful. Oh my goodness. I'd rather stay up here than down there. Look how happy everything is. Nice and green. They got cactus everywhere. Very pretty. And check out the golf course. Look how plush. Perfect time of year to be up here. And look at all the donkeys. They are everywhere up here. This is their golf course. Too funny. Alright, I'm going to get the heck out of here. 
Well, this is a really nice place. I mean, I wouldn't mind coming up here, but what a road to bring the motorhome in on. It's quite a little adventure to get back in here, but once you get here, it's like a Shangri-La. You can come out here and just picnic and stuff. You can stay out on the landing and they got tables. And like a day use thing. That wouldn't be bad. Or if you had a boat, kayak or something, you could come out and paddle around. That'd be pretty cool. Okay, well I'm going to stop up here, fly the copter again, get some more footage of some of the desert flowers. And then call it a day. Alright, this is Russ. I'm going to sign off now. Hope everyone has a great day. Hope you enjoy the aerial footage at the end of this. And don't forget to travel safe. Talk to you real soon.